and the high performance skate park of Lowers. Courtney Conlog is basically a local here. Oftentimes she gets kind of tagged as the Huntington Beach surfer, but she spent so much time out of this way. That's how you find out, you realize there is some sets on the way. Well, these surfers know they're not getting a restart. They better start swinging. It's going to be a split peak. Instead, Jesse and Conlog on the opener with Chelsea holding back. Foam climb through the inside corner. Front side little wrap in the pocket. Big swing to tail release for Conlog. Sets that rail for a nice, clean roundhouse cutback. And she is going to just put this one to bed all the way on the inside corner. Blow tail reverse to finish for Conlog. Doesn't need a warm up. Chelsea Tuak decided to hold her position. And now she's setting herself up for her opening way. The rookie from Barbados. Big section to work with. Jams it off the lip. Not one of the lower specials that Conlog just received, and it'll just be good for one maneuver. But it had such a good line that it actually broke quicker than she expected, and that's just a bummer. But the wave here, you talk about dream waves for lowers. This is one for Courtney. She saw that moving down the line. She attacks that first section, climbs that white water, and with that, sets up the inside section here. And this is where this lowers wave starts to really wind up. It slows down a little bit. The pace is there. So you're able to kind of do a full variety and different gamut of maneuvers and she knew that that's why she showed some variety had the combination of major maneuvers had the flow gets a little innovation and uh flair for there at the end of that wave so it's going to be a, a good score for courtney had a bit of pressure too we take a look in contrast here of chelsea to this wave had that first section similar to what we saw from courtney conlogs but it wasn't she wasn't able to get back out there was a, a little bit longer another 10 or 15 feet of white water down the stretch bl said he caught maybe one of the biggest waves of his whole life last winter in hawaii well and, uh, you know and at bell's beach he was on scintillating form as he likes to use uh, as one of his terms as we see some live action actually replay here of uh chelsea tuak ends up getting a 2.93 on this wave uh, has two scores just in the two-point range. Chelsea, you know, the wave choice getting a nice size set wave there. One of the biggest waves of his whole life last winter in Hawaii. Well, and, uh, you know, and at Bell's Beach, he was on scintillating form, as he likes to use uh, as one of his terms, as we see some live action. Actually, replay here of uh, Chelsea Tuak ends up getting a 2.93 on this wave. Uh, has two scores just in the two-point range. Um, I'm glad I at least got like, one fun one and got to mess around on a left. And I wanted to win the heat really bad, but um, it's all good. Like I'm super psyched for Tyler, and yeah, wishing all the girls the best. So with your performance out there, you know, are there things that you learn from in these events? Because obviously you're going to come back and surf more. Yeah, I mean... <clears throat> This heat, like, I was kind of watching it before, and it, I knew you could either be hot or cold, so it's just how the conditions are. Too. Like, I'm working on my new movie, Surf's Like a Girl, so keep an eye out. I've been filming all summer and the last three years, so it's going to be good. <laughs> all right, well, a plus for you coming back into your beautiful family. Congratulations, and we'll hopefully see you at some more events. Thank you, Strider. <laughs> Thank you, Bethany Hamilton, for putting on an all-star performance once again. Got herself out of the combination to strike back as we transition right back into live action. Little layback dagger to finish for Courtney Conlog. And now Tuok, the rookie from Barbados, has some move off the top to finish. And she'll end up stepping off. So Tuok, a couple of twos to start. Courtney's left the door open. She had that nice 7.33, but really hasn't been able to find that solid, solid backup. Let's take a look here at this one. Mid-size set wave, good line, big, strong turn for that first maneuver, but cuts it so far back that kind of has a bit of a bobble, but not really uh, affecting the wave too much as uh, a, a tiny bit of flow maybe. But again, attacking the inside sections here. Gets that layback snap, a nice explosive final maneuver. The first maneuver was good and solid, so I think this could be a great backup score now. Chelsea only needed a, a you know, a, a mid-range score at this end point, but uh, now definitely needed a much bigger score. This is going to be probably her best wave uh, with two nice turns, but again, that wave. Well, I think she uh, looked like she was kind of a little nervous at the start, but now she's settling into a rhythm, so. Had to sit on the sidelines, came back for her return at lowers, lost for the first time in round two. 
bounced back to a final in France and then was a world title for that the following season. So true, so true. And uh, it's been fun to watch, I'll tell you that. That's why we're drawn to this whole sport. An exciting back-to-back -back victories for number one and two on the Jeep leaderboard.